check one. They say that you can make a heaven on earth or a hell on earth. And the art of war is about choosing virtue over evil, like many philosophies or religions. But also this applies to work. You can make work a heaven on earth while others wander around aimlessly. And some make a hell of their job on earth, even if they're rich and, and powerful, right? And so dating is the same thing. You can make a heaven or hell of dating and relationships. The Art of War says, when your strategy is shallow and nearsighted, then what you gain from it is little. Chapter 1, Strategic Assessments. And we see this with people who date over and over, short relationships. They can't gain much from that right but the art of war says when your strategy is deep and far reaching then what you gain from it is much right and so we've seen people in long lasting relationships you, there's much to gain and learn that you can never get from dating over and over again you know the novelty wears off looks grow old but it's good you can retain that actually through being best friends you know that's really what makes relationships deep and without it they won't last you know if a guy bases his relationship solely on sexual capacity and physical looks then it will not last over time and also if a woman uses sex as a weapon her man is surely to break under the pressure because that's the only foundation he has right so you must achieve a win-win relationship at all times for it to last and that way you do not have to make it into a gateway for hell but rather uh, higher levels of heaven on earth this is Austin with the Art of War Made Easy. Stick around. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell.